Yo, it's Sway. 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 In the morning. 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 Only on Shade 45. Wake your fuck ass up. Yeah. Bitches. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, the last resort Thursdays at 8 p.m. We have one of the most celebrated actors uh, of, of our generation that's here with us today, Andre Brower. Ladies and gentlemen, give him a round of applause. Yo, man, I feel like I, I feel like I should I feel underdressed right now. You know, um, <laughs> you look great. Thank uh, you, and man. thanks for having me on the show. Absolutely, um, and it's such a timely um, series that you're part of, the Last Resort, right? Considering this election year. Um, uh, the you know one of the big arguments you know that's been taking place in um the debates is um our our security nation security mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. as well um and uh, tell us about your character in the movie. Well, uh, Marcus Chaplin is a uh, is the the commanding officer of a uh, Ohio class nuclear submarine, mm -hmm. um, and their job really is to hide with pride. They're part of. Um, the uh, the three pronged uh, nuclear deterrent that was set up, you know, more than fifty uh, fifty years ago, and so you know what what boomers these submarines do is they hide with pride. They go very slowly under the ocean, and they simply um, wait, you know, uh -huh. for to to be called upon. And um, in this case, you know, you're dealing with an elite crew, and you're dealing with patriots, and they're called upon to fire the missiles into Pakistan. But the order that comes into them is pretty shaky. Yeah. And so um, Marcus Chaplin is a man of conviction and excellence, and he starts. Uh, he begins to ask himself, um, "Is it the right thing to do to fire these missiles without the without the confirmation, knowing that there are four million people on the other uh, on the other end of this?" Mm -hmm. uh, what the series is really talking about is really what it means to be an American, and mm -hmm. that's a complicated um, uh, question to ask. And you know, we live in very contentious times in terms of what people think real patriotism is. Mm -hmm. You know. But um, I think this is a series that 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 demands that we ask questions about really what it means to be an American, mm -hmm. and it's not um, it's not following orders, it's questioning orders, um, and it's looking deeper into the things that we're asked to do and to question whether or not they're the right thing to do, yeah. um, as opposed to what an order is. And so I think we have an opportunity to um, have a. Uh, potentially have a conversation about what it means to be an American and what our American values uh, actually are and what and um, and how to promote them. That's interesting. That's why I feel like this is so timely, you know, because uh, it, it, with this presidential election, uh, <clears throat> I'm not going to ask you about your politics or anything like that, but a, a lot of questions are, are being raised about what it means to be American. You know, you have one candidate that, you know, may imply that another isn't, uh, functioning in an American way. What what what, do you, what does that mean to you personally to be an American right now? Um, the most important thing I think is to realize is that there's something larger than us that mm -hmm. we have to support. You know, oftentimes I think as people, just as human beings, we get involved in our own story and we forget that there's something um, um, life sustaining and um, um, f fundamentally. Uh, profound about this experiment in American democracy mm -hmm. and that it needs the support of concerned, engaged citizens. And so um, so getting out today to vote is yeah. important. Yeah. So, you know, uh, I've been on a press tour today, but there's nothing more important, actually more important than the press tour, is getting out of bed early enough in order to vote because mm -hmm. that vote is my expression of liberties that people died in order to, that I might, have mm -hmm. so um you know there's a time when black people couldn't vote period and that our second class citizenship which um they're always trying to thrust us back into you yeah. know what i mean mm -hmm. um uh we've got to uh do what we can to support that you know what i mean whether it be education whether it be governance whether it be um you know taxes and 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 how the the county and the state is running um uh real patriotism is getting involved in this fundamental um experiment yeah. and supporting it as best we can mm -hmm. you know so that's where i'm coming from is uh trying my best to be the best citizen i can it's sway in the morning only on shade 45